hi guys welcome back to MAMI so guys in this video we are going to learn another non-conventional machining process that is electrical discharge machining process which is also typically known as a EDM process so guys in this video we will uh, see the basic principle that is the basic principle behind the EDM process the what kind of the equipments which is used in this EDM process we'll also check out the working of the EDM process will also check out the advantages and disadvantages of EDM so guys before uh, going to our topic uh, I request to all of you to please subscribe to my channel MMI which is a educational channel and I do post videos regularly so also guys please hit the bell icon so you won't miss any of my uh, major updates so let's begin with the today's topic so guys EDM is a non-conventional process which uses the electric spark to remove the metal from the workpiece so the metal is um, metal is removed from the workpiece by the means of this electric spark so this electric spark is used as a cutting tool to cut the workpiece and to produce the desired shape so guys this is the actual representation we can call it as a line diagram of this uh, EDM process this process is done by applying the high frequency current through the electrode and workpiece basically current is supplied by the power supply basically in this case the spark removes the metal in a form of very small chips we can call it as a microchips this process is done in dielectric fluid both tool and uh, workpiece is immersed in the dielectric fluid so let's check out the working principle of the EDM so guys EDM works on the basic pr principle of the spark generation that is the metal is removed by the spark erosion the spark generation generated by this process produces the heat and this heat ultimately uh, removes the metal by erosion and evaporation on the surface of the workpiece so guys, this is the another one that is the representation of this particular process so guys the tool and the workpiece should be conductive in this case in this and this whole process is takes place in the dielectric fluid so guys let's check out the what kind of the equipments which is used in this EDM process so guys as we can see in this image the first one is the power supply the high frequency current is uh, supplied by the power supply basically which is very important factor next one is the dielectric fluid so basically this fluid acts as a vehicle to drive away the microchips which gets formed in this process so guys uh, this dielectric fluid prevents uh, the small chips from sticking to the surface of the workpiece and it also acts as a coolant basically the next uh, important equipment is a tool or we can also call it as tool holding device basically so guys basically a tool is very important factor over here and the tool also erodes as the or workpiece workpiece erodes due to that spark basically so guys the selection of the tool is very important over here which is done on the basis of the face wear ratio tool fabrication and the cost of the material basically the main materials are the copper tungsten alloy steel cast iron and stainless steel or graphite basically the next equipment which is used over here is the workpiece or we can call it as the work holding device so guys over here in this case the work in this process the workpiece needs to be a good conductor good conductor of electricity if it is good conductor of electricity then only it can be machined and it does not depends upon the hardness of the workpiece basically the hardness can be anything it can be very high or very low we can machine both the next is the working process of the EDM so this is the three this one is a 3d image guys so the tool and the workpiece are both are immersed uh, in this dielectric fluid both are submerged in the dielectric fluid and this whole process carried out in this fluid itself a servo mechanism is used which maintains the very small gap between the workpiece and the tool so this gap is very desired for proper arc formation and it is about the thickness of the human air it is very small guys the high frequency current supplied to the electrode okay which produces the spark between the tool and the workpiece 
so guys this spark generates the high in work cavity generates the heat and the metal gets removed from the workpiece due to the erosion and evaporation basically so guys we have seen this uh, also working let's talk about the advantages and disadvantages so guys every conductive material can be cut by edm it is independent of the material workpiece hardness hence the hardened workpiece can also be machined very easily in this edm process the we can cut complex die sections we can uh, do complex shapes can be easily machined and it can be having high accuracy basically this process is a blur blur free basically there is a very small amount of chip formation this section can be easily machined thin sections can be easily machined without the deforming the part so guys that was the advantages in disadvantages the machining process high, high tool wear occurs due to the spark the tool wear limits the accuracy and surface finish of the metal basically only a good conductor of the electric electricity can be machined by the edm basically so guys in this video we have seen uh, we have learned all about the edm process we have seen the working principle the process the advantages and disadvantages so guys if you like my video please hit like please do comment if you have any doubts and queries and guys please do share my videos to everyone so guys thank you for watching my video please subscribe to my channel aim ami